Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. I went to uh, a viewer by the name of Christian Bedoy. I, I hope I'm saying that right, Christian. Uh, Christian Bedoy commented on my video of the Savage 110 Elite Precision Rifle. And uh, I made the statement that the Savage 110 Elite Precision Rifle, 65 Creedmoor, was, was a 5R rifled barrel. And uh, Christian had noticed that the rifle he has, I, I'm not sure if he, if he pushed a cleaning cloth through or, or, uh, or something else, but he counted six, six marks on the bullet or, or whatever it was he pushed through the barrel there. And uh, so it certainly, to him, looked like it was uh, 6R instead of 5R. And, and he asked me to double check that. Well, I went on Savage's website, and I didn't spend a lot of time or effort doing this, but just a, a quick, quick search of Savage's website, uh, specifically about the uh, 110 Elite Precision Rifles. And it doesn't mention um, the, uh, the rifling type. If it, if how many lands and grooves it is, it it's, it tells the twist rate, which I believe is one in eight, but it doesn't say anything else. So I've got my bore scope out here, and I'm going to insert it at the muzzle end, or and um, and run it through, and we're going to see exactly how many lands and grooves this rifle does have. Please keep in mind this rifle's been shot a couple hundred times, and I have not cleaned it very well. I, I did a I have a quick once over type cleaning, but it's still kind of dirty. Okay, so here we go. And as you can see, uh, Mr. Bedoy was, was quite correct in that there are six lands and grooves there. And uh, so this is not a 5R rifle barrel, it's a 6R with a 1 8 twist. I wish I had made a video of when I first got this rifle and, and I, I did what we're doing now. Um, I, have, I have misplaced my 90 degree mirrors on my bore scope. I've got some more coming, but um, I put the 90 degree mirrors on and looked right at the walls of the uh, rifling there and it was just like a, a polished mirror. I mean, it was just beautiful. And uh, Savage has always made good barrels but typically you'll see some chatter marks, some machine marks in any barrel. And uh, this barrel was so clean and so really flawless that I'm almost certain Savage had to have you know, perhaps lead lapped the barrel. It's been lapped in some manner because it was just polished. But anyway, uh, as you can see here, definitely 6R rifling and it's the traditional lands and grooves type rifling. Uh, someone asked me if I thought it might be polyagonal rifling um, and um, I know that there are maybe a few polyagonal rifle barrels, uh, rifles, um, but uh, not many and uh, I'm not sure what the reason for that is. I've, I've read it but I just don't recall. Anyway, um, but anyway, so there you have it. Um, the Savage, uh, this is the 6.5 Creedmoor Savage 110 Elite Precision Rifle, and uh, definitely a 6R R barrel. Thanks for watching.